Hey guys, Lee, Jen here with a theme park of Ohana Short. Um, we're here on Tom Sawyer Island to check out Aunt Polly's. Aunt Polly's, which isn't always open. Yes, like today's actually the last day. It's open. It'll open now. again, uh, we think, during Easter break, Easter yes. spring break. Today is the official. Summer. Yeah, today's the official first spring break. It's not as busy as we thought it would be. But let's check out Aunt Polly's. Yeah, follow along. menu is very very unique and that's why there's so many people over here to have and try Aunt Polly's. They have the Becky's Bis Buttery Biscuit Barbecue Pork Sliders. They also have a Barks Root Beer Float and they have some other uh, unique items like this. They have soft pretzel sticks with a choice of beer cheese or nacho cheese or Creole mustard. A peanut butter and raspberry sandwich served on brioche bread. Uh, that also comes with Cajun chips, so does the pulled pork sliders. And they have a peanut butter, chocolate, hazelnut spread, and a banana sandwich. Also served on brioche bread. And the drinks are probably even more unique than the food. They have an Oddwalla lemonade slushy, a sweet tea slushy, an Oddwalla lemonade and sweet tea slushy. And if you have a sweet tooth, they also have a Mississippi mud brownie, a la mode. So we just showed you the menu, and now we'll show you what I got. And Jen's gonna watch me enjoy. She may try some of the pulled pork because I don't think she could have the biscuit itself. Yeah. But we got the Becky's pulled pork biscuits with Cajun chips. And over here, they offer a lot of great slushies. This is we got a half and half. It's like half sweet. It's like tea. an Arnold Palmer. Slushie. Yeah, it's like an Arnold Palmer slush. That is the best way to, to name that. And the cool thing is, these aren't regular chips. These are Cajun chips. I was all excited. I was like, I can eat the chips. And then I saw their Cajun flavor, which I don't eat. But Lee, are you ready? I'm ready. All right, how is it? Oh my. Is it good? Oh, wow. All right, I might have to try a little bit of the pulled pork. Yeah. We'll let you try the pork. It's real good. All right, now Jen's gonna try her portion with the Liberty Bell behind her. What a, what a place to eat. Well. Yeah, it's really good pulled pork. That's good pulled pork. All right, now Lee's going for a Cajun chip. They smell oh. spicy. Oh, really? So. Enjoy them, because I won't eat them. They're not that spicy. Yeah, okay. So I, as you can see, a lot of people turn out. Now, we're here right as it opened, and this place, there's no tables left available. That's how popular this is and how unique the food is. All right, so guys, if you're here and Aunt Polly's is open, this is a must try. Um, the food was delicious, even though Jen didn't get to really try it other than the try this, the pork. I'm loving it. Yeah, the slushy was amazing. They have a lot of really good looking slushies here. And that root beer float looks pretty good too. I miss ice cream. So it's closing today, but it's gonna reopen during Easter spring break. Yes, the week of Easter. And But be prepared. This is a popular place. Mm -hmm. And yeah. we had to wait. We had to wait to get our food and luckily we got a table. We just gave up our table. There were people waiting for tables, so. But if you're in the parks and Man Polly's is open, I suggest Let's trying try. it. Because it's a very unique dining experience because you're right on the river. You yeah. can see the steamboat go by. You got a haunted mansion there, right there in the background. It's just a great lunch, so yes. highly recommend. So if you guys enjoyed the video, hit that subscribe button. Now we're on to, to the, the next, next adventure. adventure. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.